Hi, I'm Dr. Rasya Dikshit from Dr. Dikshit Clinics, Bangalore. Common cause of uh, non-inflammatory, when, when I say non-inflammatory, I mean that it's not red, it's not painful, uh, boil on the buttock area. We are usually thinking that it is a furuncle or a hair follicle infection which could be deep-seated, which is why it is not causing so much pain. That means the body is able to take care, the immunity is able to combat the infection and it is not allowing to suppurate. However, in this area, very commonly sinuses can form from a boil. So, if you are having any discharge which is happening and the boil is more centrally located in between the buttock area, then the cause, chances of pylonidal sinus become more prominent. Both these conditions can be initially non-painful and later they can become painful. So it is better when you have, even if you have a non-painful nodule for 10 days, it is better to get an opinion from either a dermatologist or a surgeon who can examine it and decide whether any treatment is needed. Usually if it is very non-suppurative and it looks like it is going to dissolve on its own, uh, doctors will leave it alone by giving some anti-inflammatory medicines or any antibiotics. But if it is a large lesion which looks like it is going to suppurate, it is better to get it drained so that it does not cause a big scar in this area. And this area, if it suppurates, it takes a long time to heal. So it's better to take immediate medical attention just to get the problem out of the way. Every time we say prevention is better than cure, your visit to the dermatologist or the doctor doesn't have to be always for a treatment. It can just be to prevent the further complications.